there had been a hope and a sense of optimism in December that a form of rapprochement between Saudi Arabia and Qatar was proceeding. And I think that the Kuwaiti mediation had at least succeeded in opening channels of communication and dialogue. And the way that the Saudis and the Bahrainis were welcomed in Doha, the Gulf uh, in the middle of December made me and I think other people optimistic that some sort of breakthrough would happen. Uh, that it didn't happen at the GCC summit was I think in part due to pressure from Abu Dhabi on uh, the Saudi leadership not to give in and to declare an end to the crisis in the Gulf. The, the rift with Qatar, but nevertheless the, the atmosphere when uh, the Prime Minister of Qatar attended the uh, summit in Riyadh was, was noticeably warmer than in previous years. So at least I thought we were in a pattern of improved communication and better uh, atmosphere. What we've seen over the past several days is another spike in tension from the Saudi side another return to the, la the language of 27 of a user in a destabilizing actor in regional affairs. It's almost as if we've gone back to the beginning of the crisis. And so that's not a welcome development. And I think it signals that at least for now, the Kuwaiti mediation has not succeeded and that uh, Kuwait and any other interested um, uh, mediators, perhaps the US as well, will have to rethink their approach to a crisis that many had hoped was, if not ending, was at least easing.